Now, let's get started with the basic implementation of CSS. So here, in this practical implementation, we will see how we can start working with the basic CSS with the existing HTML document. So let's get started by implementing the CSS in the HTML document. So for getting started with a very basic example of CSS, what I'm going to do is I will put the style tag in the head section. In HTML, we have already learned that the head section is basically meant for putting the title or for any resources. And here I'm going to use my style as a resource. So for that, what I'll do, I'll start the thing with the style tag. And within this style tag, I can also put an attribute which will tell the MIME type since it, it will not be a basic HTML syntax. So in general way, what we do, we will put some MIME type text slash CSS. All right. Now inside this style tag, you can put the style attributes. All right. So what I'll do, I'll put for the couple of tags here, let's say for the H1 tag. So for H1, what I want to do is I want to show it with the color blue and I want to show it in the Comic Sans MS font. So for that, I'll say font family colon Comic Sans MS. So basically you can observe what I'm doing h1 is the element for which i am putting this style now inside these delimiters these curly braces i will put all these style things what i want to put and then inside this i will put the different attributes such as color is the attribute blue is the value so i will separate the attribute and the value with a colon and similarly if you want to pass multiple attributes you will pass semicolon as a separator so you can just put semicolon again and in case you want to put some more styles you can continue by putting that so this is all what i want to do for h1 similar let's put one more that is h2 and here i'll just put one style that is i want the color should be green all right so what happened when i'll come to the body and i'll simply put h1 tag with the text like welcome to tutorials point and in h2 i'll put another text simply easy learning all right so let's come back to the browser and when i'll refresh this you can see the h1 tag is coming with two attributes that is the color blue and the font is comic sans ms while the h2 tag is simply coming in the green color with the default font and all the default attributes so this is one of the way of putting this style in our coming videos i'll show you what are the different ways to style the html document like whether it will be inline the out, out, outside some file or like embedding the style in this way. But this is all for now.